All right, hey there guys. This is another video that I've had requested um, and this is more to help out um, newer players or honestly, just anyone who might need this uh, because it is kind of confusing and it's gonna be based on the currency exchange and how it works and how to kind of read it. Uh, this is something that I had some issues with for a bit when I first started playing the game. So it's a good little information to have. Uh, and of course, if you want to help the channel out, leave a like. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet, always looking for another subscriber. We're trying to get to 750 before the end of the year. I think we can do it. You guys have been wonderful to me. Appreciate each and every one of you. All right, let's get back into the video. So how does the currency exchange work? What is the currency exchange? Let's start there. So the currency exchange is a tab in the store tab here. So we go to store. And then down here is the currency exchange uh, where you can buy blue crystals for gold and then buy gold for royal crystals. So royal crystals you buy with uh, real money. Blue crystals you can buy with gold. Royal crystals buy you gold. Gold buys you blue crystals. Make sense? Not really. Well, hopefully I can make it make a little bit more sense. So on the purchase gold tab, what does this mean? How do you buy gold? Well, very easily, this is where you go if you want to sell royal crystals for gold. How does it pick this price? Well, so you see here it says crystal purchase offers. So these are prices that people have listed to that they want to buy um, crystals at. So if I go over here, this means somebody typed in 333. So they want to buy... Uh, a stack of 100 crystals for 33333 gold. And that's why it was 3333. Now it's 33305 because that's the highest one. Somebody um, sold somebody some crystals. Um, how does it convert the royal crystals to blue crystals? Well, it does it automatically. As you can see, it's 238 royal crystals to 95 blue crystals. Or in this case, 100, but it takes 5 off for tax. So you kind of see how that works. So whatever the highest offer is here is what it'll automatically populate here with. But this is what people are listing it for. So there's somebody listing 952 Royal Crystals, which I think would be three, four. So four sets of those for three, three. Well, let's go here. Three, 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 three. So this is what somebody's doing there. Somebody just bought it. And then on the Buy Crystals tab, it's the same thing. Except instead of auto populating down here, it auto populates here. So now it's 3305 because that's the cheapest one listed. So if you want to buy it instantly, that's what it draws from. But if you want to slow buy things, you can list it for like 3300. And then that would add here. But you wouldn't insta buy because this is what the insta buy price is. And this just sells, tells you what the recent sales have been. Realistically, the only thing you have to look at is... Either if you're selling, you look here to see what people are listing to buy for and what people are listing to sell for, or if you're buying what people are listing here for as well. Hopefully that makes sense. I'll try to just do a very basic explanation real quick. Purchase gold means you're selling royal crystals that you bought with real money for gold. This is how much people are trying to buy crystals for. This is how much people are trying to sell royal crystals for. If you don't want gold instantly, you go up here and try to sell it. If you want gold instantly, you go down here and you pick a price and try to sell it. Buy crystals is you're paying your in-game gold for blue crystals. This is what people are trying to sell blue crystals for. This is what people are trying to buy blue crystals for. Make sense? Makes sense. Okay. Hopefully that helps you guys out. Hopefully it made sense. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, as always, like the video if you like the video, dislike it if you dislike it, and make sure to subscribe if you haven't. See you guys all in the next one. Bye!